What is going on guys and in today's video I'm going to be showing you some of the best ways to make passive money while you play the game. Let's check it out. First what you're going to want to do is you're going to own a salvage yard. If you own a salvage yard the best thing to do is buy that tow truck. If you have the tow truck you can do these tow truck missions. So simply hop in the tow truck, click on the first option and it's going to pull you outside the garage. Then from there it'll give you the exact directions. You're going to tow the Declassy Voodoo. It's going to give you exactly where it is on the minimap and all you have to do is drive all the way right to where the location is. Lucky for me it was nice and close so it'll make it fast. Once you're there you're going to lower your crane, you're going to back up to the vehicle and you're going to tow it away. Once you're hooked up bring it right back to the shop and it's as simple as that. Super easy, super fast. Sometimes there will be ones where the cops will pull up on you and you need to lose them um, but for this one luckily for me I didn't have to do that. Once you're back in your garage with that first vehicle hop in the tow truck and do the exact same thing over. All you're gonna do is you're gonna get the car back up to it hook it up and bring it right back to the shop. Simple as that super easy and look at that I got two of them. So that's why you're gonna want to own two of the mechanics. If you don't own the big safe it is alright your small safe will still manage to rack up a hundred thousand dollars in passive money. As you can see mine's at 48,000 right now but the longer you sit on it and the more you have your people salvaging your cars the more money you're going to make. It will cap out at $100,000 so if you want to make more passive money you need to buy the bigger safe for the salvage yard. The next best way to make a ton of passive money while you're just simply playing the game is to keep your nightclub popularity at maximum popularity. As you can see mine's a little bit low and the thing about this is it's super easy. So when you enter your nightclub you're going to get a text from Marcel. Either you're going to have a VIP that's too drunk and passed out and he needs to be brought to the hospital or you're going to have somebody who's creating a problem and you need to throw them out or they're puking in the bathroom. One of those three could possibly happen and all you got to do is go over to the person on the map or the blue dot, interact, and for this one it's going to be bring the VIP to the hospital. Lucky enough for me, it's a very, it's a super nice and close hospital, so I don't have to drive very far, it doesn't take very long, but you need to make sure that you don't drive too fast and you don't crash, because if you spook your VIP, you will end up losing it. And just like that, for finishing that super quick mission for two minutes, $10,000 I got rewarded, plus my popularity went all the way back up to full. Now what you want to do is you're going to want to go back to your wall safe, and then you can collect your, your, your passive money. I mean, simple as that. $50,000 for me, this will cap out at $250,000 in passive money, so you need to make sure once you hit that wall, once you hit that maximum, you go collect it because you won't be making any more money after that. So for me, I'll grab my 50 grand and I'm out of there just for nothing. And all I'm doing is playing the game. For a little bit of a bonus content, some of the daily challenges throughout the map, you can do these junk energy bike trials. These make a ton of money for just a very short amount of time. So what you want to do is you're going to find, want to find that logo on the map, go on, go on over to it, get into the purple circle, and hit right on the D-pad. And all you have to do is simply just complete the time trial within the, within the time stated. So for me, it's 2 minutes and 10 seconds. Once you finish it, $52,000 just like that for doing nothing. And what do you know? Look at that. My palace has gained $50,000 from me just playing the game. That's my nightclub. Another, another bonus content thing is doing these stash houses. These pay out pretty nicely. So what you're going to do is you're going to find this logo on the map, go on over to it, kick in that door, and then eliminate all of the enemies on the inside. Then you're going to want to look for that yellow sticky note with the three let numbers on it. Enter that combo into the safe and steal the contents. Once you steal the contents, exit the stash house and leave the area. And as you can see, these will refill if you own any hangar, bunker, counterfeit cash, anything like that. It's going to refill that to maximum capacity. So instead of actually going out there and doing it, it'll just fill it for you. The last and final piece of bonus content is doing the G's cash. Simply find this logo on the map and head right on over to it. Once you're there, you're going to have a gray circle, and what you're going to do is look around the map and look for the G's cash. It's simple as that. Once you find it, pick it up, and you'll be rewarded $17,000. It'll refill your ammo and your snacks. Super easy, super quick. And there we go. Just for playing the game, my voodoo has been salvaged for $33,000. So every 48 minutes, you will get paid out by your mechanics because they fully salvaged your vehicles, and I got another one for $32,000. So combined with $65,000 for simply just playing the game and having fun. And that's the end of the video, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you smash that like button. Leave a comment down below if you wanna see a certain type of video. I love making these for you guys. You showed a ton of love on the last one. I really appreciate it for the views, the comments, and the likes. Other than that, I'll see you in the next one.